Chef. An ultra high frequency is UHF. which are used by hams for line of sight communication using small handheld two-way radios popularly known as walkie-talkies. Uh, view 3 Sierra Fox Fox, this is Victor Uniform 2, Mike Uniform Echo. Do you copy me? Uh, this is View 3 FFF, uh, any station copying, over. View 3 Sierra Fox Fox. Video. The line of sight communication view depends on the height of the radio antenna as these signals are not reflected by ionosphere. Uh, I'll give you a call after 10 minutes, 10, 10, 15 minutes maybe. So yeah, 73 is for now. So in open space, without obstructions, depending on the height of the antenna. So, during disasters, a ham operator can carry his small set to the affected region and start transmitting information, which can be used by the rescue operators to reach the affected regions with relief aids. In between, I, I'm not getting a phone signal, uh, that's why I'm on radio, uh, come again. Uh, we hope everything is fine at your location. Do you have any message? View 3 CLR Fox Fox, this is due to Mike Uniform Echo. Uh, view 2 MOE, View 3 SFF. Yes, I'm, I'm trying to get my coordinates. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure where I am, I'm just sitting under a tree. Okay, okay, I got it. I'm waiting for your longitude radio information, uh, We have lots many ham radio satellites, so uh, orbiting satellites, so they low Earth orbit. Matlab around 400 to 800 km altitude pe ughumte rehte at a speed of about 20 to 25,000 km per hour. Suppose I am at Uttarakhand at a remote area and I am stuck up there due to some emergency situation. If I know uh, the pass of that satellite, I can beam the antenna to that satellite. And that because that satellite has a footprint, footprint, so it will cover about 1,500 to 2,000 km area. So my signal from Uttarakhand will come through this two-way radio the line of sight hota hai, matlab, short distance we, they, that can come through that satellite even uh, the signal may reach uh, to 2000 km so i don't need to depend on some cell phone network for that